Hello everyone. Welcome to Zeppo's how-to video series. In today's video, we're going to talk about how to connect your Zeppo environment to Redshift. If you want to create a Redshift cluster from scratch, I am going to link the instructions below to create a cluster. In this video, we already have a Redshift cluster running on AWS. First, let's configure interpreter by clicking on the Zeppo icon, select resource, select interpreters, and from here we can create an interpreter. First, I'm going to select JDBC as the type of interpreter, then I'm going to give it a name. Since we're connecting to Redshift, I'm going to name the alias Redshift. From here, I already have a Redshift cluster running on AWS. I'm just going to provide the URL, also the port number and default database. Make sure to put in your username and password and click on test connection. As you can see, the connection is successful and click on apply. Now I see Redshift showing up as my list of interpreters. From here, I can create a new notebook called Redshift Demo, and then I can select the size of the container that I want to use. Now I choose Redshift as my interpreter. Click on Submit, create a new notebook. From here, I'm going to create a simple table for my Redshift environment. Click on Run. And now I can see that this table is created in my Redshift database successfully. Thank you for joining us. See you next time.